It was Ishmash that at the end of the 1940s, under the guidance of the legendary small arms designer Mikhail Kalashnikov, mastered mass production of the new Kalashnikov assault rifle AK-47, and since that moment for 60 years has been developing its upgraded models. Modern AK assault rifles not only feature all combat-proven advantages of the world-renowned AK-47 and AKM, but also provide enhanced reliability, accuracy and ergonomics. There are assault rifles in two main envelopes, with standard and short barrels, and in three calibers. The AK-101 and AK-102 assault rifles are in caliber 5.56 by 45 NATO. The AK-103 and AK-104 are built to round the cartridge of 7.62 by 39. The AK-74M and AK-105 are in caliber 5.45 by 39 Russian. The assault rifles with short barrels AK-102, AK-104, AK-105 are the weapons made specifically for airborne troops, marines and forces of special deployment whose combat tactics are of exceptionally mobile character. The main distinguishing features of the new AK are advanced production technology, new materials and technical solutions. Forearm, magazine, buttstock and pistol grip are made of high strength plastic. All assault rifles have folding stocks. The muzzle brake provides full auto fire accuracy and further reduces muzzle climb, burst recoil and flash. The AK can be equipped with a sound suppressor. There is a dovetail side rail for optical collimator or night sights. The iron sight ensures optimal vision and comfort during the shooting. It is possible to attach a knife bayonet or an underbarrel grenade launcher. During manufacturing, the assault rifle undergoes numerous tests, including high and low temperature tests, dust chamber tests, heavy rain chamber tests. Russian Kalashnikov assault rifles have several advantages that cannot be countered by any other small arms, such as easy and comfortable operation, easy maintenance and repairs, and top reliability under any conditions. Thanks to its extraordinary features, the AK has become the main assault rifle both for the national armed forces and the armies for many other countries.